So WBON TV is out here at Will Green Lake in Madison County, and it may look a little quiet. Part of this may be because the dock, as you can see behind me, has been closed for quite some time. We talked to Deputy Judge Executive for the county, Colleen Cheney, who said the ramp is still open. It's still open for business down here. You can go fishing, come out to visit, but the dock will probably not be reopening for quite some time. We'll have her tell you why. Visit the walk-in clinic at Mercy Primary Care of Irvin on Friday evenings and weekends with no appointment necessary. Walk-in care is open to the community no matter who your doctor is. For those times when it's not serious enough to go to the ER, but you feel too bad to wait until Monday, walk in to Mercy Primary Care of Irvin. Will Green Lake is an interesting story. So Will Green Lake was a lake that had a private entity running it when we first came into office. But there was a significant amount of deferred maintenance. And so when we came in and got out there, the dock was not safe. So we did a lot to kind of ensure that it was boat ready. And so it, because it is so remote, having people, you know, out there doing fishing off the dock. And that was just at this point, not something we're quite ready. If people want at their own risk to go into the water on a boat, you know, the ramp is available to do that. And so we do have people who do fishing tournaments out there and do events out there, but the dock is pretty expensive. We had people who were maintaining their boats down there, so we made the decision at that time to just hold off. Now, we have talked to a couple of private entities that have been interested in um, potentially manning, but then once we talk about the maintenance needed and we kind of go out and look at it with them, most of them back off immediately. The dock is closed. You can't be on the dock because of the safety of the cost. Um, for us to repair, we just don't want people on the dock. But the ramp is, is usable, and we have people out there all the time. We do have a lock system where we lock it after hours, and we do have a sheriff deputy that patrols it at night um, just to make sure we don't have any drug activity going on down there. We have installed two porta potties. It is approved for boating, not swimming. And we would, you know, obviously we do fishing tournaments, but that fish is not for consumption. We still maintain the dam, all of the all of the vegetation to code with Army Corps of Engineers. So, no, we are still actively on, in, on that property, um, and it's just we will not be replacing the dock or serving as a marina anytime in the near future. We did talk to some locals that were down here to fish for bluegill, and they told us that it is a pretty quiet lake these days, which they can't really argue with because they kind of have it to themselves, so that means more fish for them. However, they say back in the day, there used to be tons of fishing tournaments and other stuff going down here. So it shall be seen if this ever reopens. For WBON-TV, I'm Marissa Hempel.